What's up, everybody? It's Mayor. Recently, I was on NFT Action News, and I talked a lot about Crypto Monkeys and a lot about the ecosystem. And it was a fairly long interview, but there's a lot of really cool info in there. So I'm going to post that right here. You should check it out. Make sure you click subscribe so that you're up to date on things in the future. And I will see you there. Hey, hey. So big show, let's go, let's go. It is Crypto Monkey Friday. That's right, February 18th. We are live, the NFT Action News. And I'm joined by, as always, on a Crypto Monkey Friday, Recurrier, Uncle Rico. How are you feeling today? Doing good. Exciting day, exciting times. Yes, indeed, indeed. And uh, I see we have a, a new face to the to the action. Family studio here, Mr. Mayor from the Crypto Monkeys team. How are we, man? What's up, folks? I'm uh, I'm actually like a bit overwhelmed by the amount of um, images on the screen right now. So I'm, I'm kind of <laughs> like I'm all over the place, but I'm great. You know, it's the 18th. If we if I was a smarter person, we would have talked about doing it on the 19th because yeah. 19 is a very significant number yes. in the Crypto Monkeys community. So. Yeah. But here we are. We'll just say it's plus one. <laughs> it's the 19th over uh, no. some part of the world by now. Very true. I'm going to go with that. I hope that's right. Yeah. So <laughs> so what's up? Not much. Yeah, Your what birds. is up? Um, what is, what's going on with the monkeys? Uh, where do we begin with? Uh, I mean, I know that you've started kind of, you've shown up kind of recently on the monkey team and you have. I am new. You're yes. running um, some some Twitch programming. Is that what you're doing, or no? So we got another guy named Aku who does the Twitch. Um, so I'm going to drop right now YouTube.com/slash/CryptoMonkeys, and the links are in the chat right there. Is that private chat? Yep, I'll grab that. And share it. See that? All right. So that's our that's our YouTube channel. Um, it's fairly new. It's about a month and a half old. We're nearly at a thousand subscribers. So as they say, monkeys together strong. Um, we got a really great community. So are, are you guys, I know Recurrier or Uncle Rico, I know you're in the community. Um, are you in the community as well? I should do this way. I am probably not, okay. not as much so as Uncle Rico for sure. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely uh, a huge fan of the Crypto Monkeys. Been around them right. since, uh, since I first found them, basically. We kind of. So you're probably older than I am. So. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, but we, I've done a lot of research. And so what I can tell you is this is that, um, and I don't have notes here, I, I look around when I'm talking, but uh, they are freely distributed and they are fairly distributed. And that is not something that you're going to find um, in nearly any other uh, organization. It's all about money, right? So all these NFTs that you see everywhere is a big cash grab. And of course, these are available on Atomic Hub, which is which is a wax organization. But um, you, you can buy them secondary, but these are freely distributed. And if you're in our crypto, uh, if you're in our, our crypto, if you're in our chat, which is chat, I'm going to drop this chat dot crypto. To monkeys.cc if you wouldn't mind sharing that that yep. is our discord channel so you go there you click you verify that you're not um, a fake human being or some type of AI and then um, you're in the chat and it's a really fun place to just exist and, you know it's um, crypto monkeys is a, a sister to or a brother or whatever to banana banana inspired um, and of course banana is a cryptocurrency it is also freely distributed um, so we're really going for that. And I think that's something really special. And and because of that, we've got a really wholesome community, um, a very helpful community, and it's just a lot of fun to be part of. Yeah, the Crypto Monkey community, the Banano community are pretty insane for sure. Um, I don't know about that. No shenanigans. That We might need to take that off of there because there's definitely a lot of shenanigans on, on the Discord for sure. <laughs> Yeah, the discords get going crazy. I mean, sometimes you pop in there on some days when it's just nuts and it's like you can't even keep up with. with the yeah, and that the banana, the jungle is is far worse. <laughs> so yeah. that is truly a jungle. It's very wild. Um, and, you know, we've got some some people in there that moderate it. But that is um, that is definitely a, a oftentimes not suitable for work. But we try to keep crypto monkeys a little bit more wholesome. Um, and we're we're really aiming 
uh, to bring people into the NFT and crypto space. Okay, so because it's free and because it's fairly distributed, it is really something that people can grasp at an early age. You know, people who are, of course, meeting the, the Discord requirements of 13 years old or older um, are allowed to enter and participate. And, um, you, know, we tr you know, I try to prevent, you know, big boy chat sometimes. But it's a really great way for people to get started. You know, kids don't have money. Some kids do, but most kids don't. And this is this is just an awesome way to get started. Yeah, I mean, when we when we kind of came across Crypto Monkeys, um, brother, my brother Left House is usually here hosting the show. He like he completely fell in love with uh, just the whole idea of that free freely distributed NFTs, and then that kind of it kind of sparked an idea over here at left and we started uh, kind of mocking up some ideas between my brother and my son who's 15 and they started creating lefty who's now like one of our major yeah uh, releases. i think we might have a stack coming out soon so that's yeah. a whole other thing we can talk about so if we even start talking once you get me started talking about what we actually do it's it's i hope you've got time on this tape <laughs> but um, but we, we got a lot going on, guys. I mean, so obviously you see these cards here, right? So um, I, I'm using my mouse and you can't see it on your screen. But um, so Soggy Apple Pie, that's her name. She is um, the sole artist of these cards. We recently, one of the cards we just put out um, was was actually in conjunction with another community member named Chiara. But um, I mean, she pretty much does all the work and they're awesome. And, and what's really amazing about this entire ecosystem um, is that there's there's all sorts of of usages built into having these cards from um, you being able to mine them in alien worlds. Um, you can use them in uh, what we call monkey slots. So every day you can earn free banana just by the more cards you have, the more slot pools you get. The rarer they are, the faster they reset. Um, I mean, there's uh, there's a billion. I could pull up the page here and, and start naming them. But if you go on the Discord, literally in the channels, it's it's just all listed. Um, and so, you know, within that, there's also stacks, which is a relatively new thing that's been happening. They pumped out a, a whole lot of them during Christmas. There's monkey slots. Hey, and it says API not reachable. There's usually a little button up in the top. It's got a little monkey face. You connect your wax wallet or your anchor. Um, uh, and, and essentially, you're, it, it pulls from that. It sees which cards you have. And then they, after they've been used, they freeze. So it looks like um, we're, you are having a little bit of trouble, but if we, uh, let me see if I can pull it up. Am I able to screen share? Yeah, definitely. Let me see. For sure. Let me get mine pulled up here. Yeah, monkey slots are, are a hoot. They're, it's they're awesome. Uh, I do it every day. I mean, I wake up, I get it started. It's got autoplay, so I, I just click autoplay. I go get the kids ready, and then um, I come back, and it's either stalled out or something. So, um Let's see. How do I? Here we go. Can I share real quick? Share screen. It's telling me that I need to close all the windows. I don't want people to see. Um, so whatever. Okay. Can, can we all see this? Let me bring that in there. Yeah, there oh, we go. Whoa. Okay. So here's some monkey slots, right? So it tells you down here. This is really cool. It tells you your chance of of earning a profit. And then it also tells you your chance to win. Now it's pulling three cards. So if I if I spin it, you know, you can change your bets here. Hey, I won. So it tells me what I won. It gives you an expected value. But um, but essentially I hit on two cards. Right. So um, you can also um, hit autoplay and then like go back to, you know, doing something else. And, you know, it just it just does it automatically. It's just a really fun thing. Um, so monkey slots is super cool. Um, it's just one of the many things that are that are integrated into the uh, the crypto monkeys ecosystem. So it's pretty deep. Yeah, that's for sure. Um, like you mentioned, we have some of our uh, we have a collaboration finally put together here with our Action Family Club card, um, and we're, we might see some stacks showing up pretty soon. Hey man, so let's talk stoked. about stacks, baby. Listen, <laughs> I. I am like the, I'm like one of the biggest fans of stacks and, and I'll be a hundred percent honest why it's because I have all of them. Okay. So there we go. <laughs> Who put that up? 
I don't um, know what's going on here. Am I, I supposed to bring these guy guys? You Maji is my. I made that with my own finger on my phone. So somebody, somebody sniped that off, <laughs> off of Discord. So. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so stacks are um, are another thing. So that's another way of um, different creators and um, artists within the community and other communities collaborators to to also participate in the free and fairly distributed NFT ecosystem that we have. Um, and there's some stuff inside of, of stacks that I may or may not be able to talk about. And there may end up being something involved with a game type thing later. Maybe not, who knows? Um, but at this point, I mean, they're included in this wombat dungeon. I don't even play it, but apparently people are able to take monkey stacks and uh, hide them in the dungeon and you earn um, points or something off of that. I, I, and I'm not doing it. I don't know. I don't know anything about it, but it sounds awesome. There's already usage. The value on Atomic Hub has bumped up a little bit because of that. So that's pretty cool. Everybody likes value, but um, you know, there's a lot going on and these, and these stacks are all over the place. So as you can, as you, you know, you know, your left house stack is very unique compared to um, many of the other stacks that came out. For instance, we just had one, um, with the cat stickers NFT project. And it's the only cat I like on this planet. Um, and it's super duper cute, little cat holding a banana. Um, and, uh, and yeah, that went over really well. It was distributed to their community largely. Um, and so, you know, it's a win-win situation in these collaborative efforts. It's awesome. Yeah, I love seeing communities come together, and especially with the monkeys. I mean, uh, you go down the stack page, and it's just like all of the different artwork coming in. It's and trying to figure out what collection is which one, and it's, it's pretty fun and dope to see. And then we're very blessed that these in our ecosystem with with not only great artists, but we have really great coders. We have really great designers. Um, we've got um, just we really do have brilliant people. Um, and problem solvers and you know as somebody that works in the marketing industry being able to call upon someone to solve a problem for you is such a huge is such a huge thing and not to mention we have um a, a robot running the organization named bantano um he's not <laughs> actually a robot i just joke about it because he just does an inhuman amount of stuff yeah um but and he's awesome and it's just um it's really great it's a really unique place for sure. And all of these stacks are leading up to there, there's a game being formed around the stacks. Is that what's happening or? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> so I, um, I talked about that in one of the videos I've been, I had been pushing that like, Oh, the game factor, the game factor. And I want to be very careful to mention that um, while there are statistics that aren't included on the crypto monkeys cards, there are statistics on these stacks. Um, and they are various, you know, one stack may have different stats than the other. Um, it, we may or may not be implementing that. I, I imagine it will happen. I, I believe in the team. Um, yeah. But at this point, there's nothing, there's nothing that I have concrete to give you about that. Right. Um, the enough. same as the code on the back of the Crypto Monkeys cards, which I imagine is possibly a question coming up next. I don't know what it means. So if you pull up any of the cards, there's a, there's a QR code on the back. Um, they won't tell me. <laughs> so <laughs> I really don't know what it means, um, but it means something. And they're really pumped about it. Like even Soggy said in one of, in the last interview that we did on YouTube, on our channel, she was pumped about talking about it. She said she may talk about it very soon. It may be released very soon, but I promise I don't know. So I'm, I'm kind of, they give me a little bit of information and I'm just like, go talk about it. So, yeah. But yeah. Very cool. Very cool. Do you have your stack that you guys designed? Are you, or is it done? Do you want to pull it up and show everybody? So I saw, I, my brother left house sent me kind of the mock-ups that were being sent over to the team and kind of working back and forth between, uh, someone over there, Crypto Monkeys, it might've been Bantano or someone um, that works on the artwork for the stacks and they were kind of like fine tuning, but I, have, I haven't seen the final version. I just have kind of like the, the demos that were going back and forth at this point. Yeah, well, there's a lot. I mean, so the, it goes through periods where there's like 
five in a row that come out. So like I just I'm actually editing currently in this room um, a weekly update because, you know, life happens and they put out three cards in one stack within four days or five days. And I was like, OK, I can't do a video for each one. of these. So I did it. I did it all at once. And so that'll be coming out hopefully um, in the next couple of days. Um, but yeah, I mean, they sometimes are pumping these things out and it depends on a lot on when, you know, the collaborator collaborators finish the work and, you know, it gets approved and everybody's, you know, kind of on board with it. But other than that, um, you know, there's, I mean, they, they have a joke where they say monkey printer go burr and, um, and they went burr this week. So yeah. a lot of stuff. I love that saying. Yeah. It's awesome. <laughs> it's also the first card. Um, yeah. The, the monkeys um, series and so it's uh, nearly unobtainable because it's it's very very rare um, and and completely absorbed by um, those who wanted it so it's hard to get a hold of probably very expensive so yeah and then brother go ahead Rico I have a nice collection but I'm missing a couple um, a couple early ones that I just couldn't get so you got legendaries yeah, I have a bunch of legendaries. Oh, don't please don't brag or anything. <laughs> um, <laughs> I have one. I have one. As, as well, my, I mean, uh, it yeah. helps that I was on the Crypto Monkeys team starting like month two. So yeah. sure, um, I'm very new to this, so I've, yeah. I've been working I, quite hard to try to um, outpace everyone else. So. Yeah, I don't have um, Monkey Printer Go Burr, and then I am missing. Uh, two others in um, Gen One. This is fine yeah. and Monkey Brains because those are really hard this to get. Fine and Monkey Brains. Those yeah. are two very very popular cards. Yeah, yeah. I, my ones. legendary is is Gingerbread Monkey. So um, I think that's the most recent legendary one. Um, and yeah. so I'm I'm pleased as punch to say that I got one because I, I believe it's. Um, you know, there's only 19 of those. Every every legendary, there's only yeah. 19 of those cards. So it's extremely, extremely hard to get. And not only that, it's it's um, they're held onto. You know, these things are like yeah. a store of value. We just auctioned one off. That's a that's kind of a good segue for us to um, to talk about the charity initiatives um, that Crypto Monkeys are are doing and have done in the past. Um, we recently auctioned off. Um, a card. Let me pull this up so I make sure I get all of my information correct. Um, we recently auctioned off a card and uh, it sold for like 3,000 wax. Let's see uh, if you'll give me just a moment. I like to try to be prepared, but I didn't realize I was going to say that. Um, oh, yeah. So here it is. So we sold this card. Um, the starting bid was one wax, 33 cents. Uh, and the final bid, it was buy the dip. Uh, mint number one, which is a uh, which is unbelievable, uh, and it sold for one thousand one hundred and twenty nine dollars and forty four cents, which is nearly thirty five hundred wax. Um, Dude, I should have paid closer attention. I would have bought. That's that. a good deal, deal right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. That's yeah, cheap. that's a good deal on a legendary. So I, I actually bid on it, and I just did. I don't have enough wax to do that. So. Oh man, I should have. <laughs> My I wife might have paid closer me. attention. I could have bought that one. Yeah, <laughs> I'm, number one. I'm, mint, uh, so. Right now, I'm seven cards away from a complete set. Dang. Mm. Yeah, so, and so it's, it's worth knowing that the sets one. are rated as well. So if if you have a great set, depending on the mints and stuff, um, ba of course, Bantano's set is the number one rated set. Uh, he owns wow. all the yeah. number 19 cards and yeah. stacks. You're yeah. never going to get a 19 unless something happens to him. Um, and I imagine it, it can't because his systems are updated regularly. <laughs> um, you know, he's he, his firmware. So um, but other than that, you know, your your your, your uh, collections are, are rated. And, and so um, the, the three monkey printers, you know, who are Bantano, Viren and Soggy Apple Pie. Um, theirs are up there at the top. Clearly, nobody if anybody has any questions why I guess you you don't understand um, how this works. But <laughs> other than that, we've got a lot of people who are really close. So um, Uncle Rico, I'm interested to know where yours is ranked. So I dropped anyway. recently because I shifted some stuff around. Right now I'm ranked 16. I was, I was a little higher. 
but I've been moving some things around. So, so I'm 57 out of 16,713. And I, that's, that's decent. But I mean, once you get, you know, it's a really hard jump to go up one yeah. number from where I'm at right now. So I'm, I'm, I'm currently finishing out rares. I have like four more rares to get. Um, I only have one Epic and one, one legendary. So my Epic is yeah. the Nyan cat, um, which is or Nyan monkey, excuse me. Um, I love that one. Yeah. It's awesome. Yeah. You know, and they work with, you know, obviously the designs, um, we have some artists that we, that we work with within our community that help to animate some of those, those cards that are animated. So, um, just a, just a really, really solid community. So, of, so right now I've got 21 common, 22 uncommon, not counting duplicates, 25 rares, nine epics and seven legendaries. Woo. All right. all, well, was, I'll so see then, myself out. <laughs> <laughs> well, Why it helps to talk about this stuff. Why am I here? It helps to be well, I, mostly <laughs> because I I launched my own company, so um, it's it's Rock been roll, man. it's been tough, um, you know, filling in time wise. Uh, but yeah, I was I was on the Crypto Monkeys team first uh, before launching Metaforce, and um, yeah, I mean, I I was lucky because I was I was along for the ride the whole time these were coming out and um i helped build several of the crypto monkeys initiatives um i helped build the monkey mining i helped build the upland initiative i had helped to do a bunch nice. of stuff have you seen but, upland recently oh yeah i'm in upland all the time yeah that the, it has developed quite nicely so yeah. it's, it's like a freaking banana oasis in there um, yeah so that is that is rad um, and yeah, monkey mining. So I'm actually doing a video about kind of deep diving into monkey mining. Well, I say deep diving, but we're going to we're going to make a very thorough um, video on how to get started in doing that for people who are kind of just joining. And, you know, what, what happens when people join the server is there's like this sort of mania. How do I get these cards? How do I get these cards? And it's cool. Like, I, I mean, I did the same thing. I'm like, what do I do? What do I do? Um, yeah. And there's plenty of ways to get it, you know. Um, you just have to be willing to put in a little bit of time. And then there's always the chance of, you know, rarities. Obviously, most of the time you're going to get commons. Sometimes you get uncommons. Rarely you get rares. That's what the rarities are for. Um, and, you know, I think recently we had um, we had a, a legendary drop out of the, the Green Wizard, like just drop bot in the chat. It, yeah. It's no insane. Can you just can you imagine being gifted something valued at a minimum of fifteen hundred dollars? <laughs> just you know oops here it is so yeah. i mean how cool is that you're not going to find that anywhere else that's pretty awesome yeah man legendary green wizard yeah, yeah I, gee whiz i'm curious where i would be if i consolidated everything to one wallet yeah so now the you, wheels so on monkey again, connect you can connect leaderboard. all of your different wallets and um and be able to so if you go on to monkey oh, connect and you connect yeah. all of your different wallets so it that's where I'm all at. of your assets that's where i'm at now but the collection score does it it'll push it all to that it should i believe so yeah um but again i'm not the you know i'm not the the genius behind this i believe that would be like green or someone like that um, have one of our log. coding wizards yeah i'll have to log into all of them but um, yeah yeah for sure yeah, maybe if i log into all of them i'll so between Monkey Connect and Cardamon, so when you go to the Cardamon. I like Cardamon. Yeah, so Cardamon.link, um, when you go there uh, and you go to main, in your main homepage, there's a there's a button that says join now in the middle. And right there it says linked accounts. You can kind of link up. I've got, um, you know, two Anchor accounts and one Wax Wallet account. Um, and I use Anchor, of course, because it's a bit more secure. So definitely my legendaries and legendary and um, the the expensive ones are uh, behind that extra layer of protection in the um, in the anchor wallet you know so but anyway you can connect all of those on the um, on the cardamon page and then you know you can choose whether you want to how you want to interact with other people for swapping or monkey matching and stuff like that that's another thing man you can earn cards by monkey matching so we have another currency called monkey and if you um, do monkey matching, there's a whole channel where you just trade cards temporarily with people through Atomic Hub. Um, you verify that you have the cards, you earn monkey, and then you can buy prizes. You can buy epics and, and packs and stuff on this page. It's awesome. Crazy. Awesome. 
Yeah, I don't know yeah. where I've been. I've been paying attention. Yeah, where have I've you been? been. <laughs> Look, listen, as somebody who's been here since, you know, I, I've, I've been like kind of thrust into this relatively quickly, but I've been at, at the beginning of, of December, really, is when I, I started kind of deep, deep diving into this. Um, it's it's nuts uh, how much is going on in this. And then kind of once once I got handed the keys to the kingdom, so to speak, um, as a super monkey uh, on the Discord channel, it's even it's even more. So oh, it's um, yeah, it's it's wild. It gets crazy in there. I, it's uh, wild. I can't like. There's so much. There's so much stuff moving on, moving and happening behind the scenes. Um, it's, it's it's a lot. I could never <laughs> even even before I was doing Mount of Force, it was hard to keep up with all of it. Uh, and, but uh, we have an awesome team, and and yeah, I, sure. I'm not saying that. And I'm not being paid to say that or anything. Yeah. We really do. Like I, like I don't know what I'm doing for the most part in anything except making videos, really. Um, and I can ask just about any question, and I get an answer like in a, in a zip. And, and you know, we've got people from all over the world on these team on this team that's that's operating within the Discord channel. Um, there's a lot of the the reddit page has kind of fallen off and i believe we we just got somebody on board to start kind of bringing that back to life you know separate of banana but um we've got people all over the world so literally any time of day there's some type of moderator online who has a talent and a skill in doing something important um, that can help um, or can guide you in finding um, what it is you're looking for so it's 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 great that's huge yeah just to just to keep have, have that engagement, you know, and then it's like people taking turns in there to to make sure the, the Discord's running smoothly and people coming in or have questions answered or you know just being there. That's huge. I offer my opinion probably more than than I should. So, <laughs> so I'm like, hey, what if we do this? And maybe hey, we should try this or whatever. And then it's like it just gets like passed over. So but that's okay. Yeah, that's that's part of what it is, man. I'm an I'm an idea guy monkey. and I, I spew them out. So yeah, take you gotta throw them it, out right? there. So throw them out there and see which ones stick, you know, and then start rolling. I need me so some I'm hoping about this love. left house and, and we're gonna have to get a Metaphors comics stack here soon as well. You know what I mean? Yeah, I put one in, it just never came to fruition. I never saw I actually it. have my sketch right here. Let's so see it. Here. Yes. The prototype. It's white. Oh. oh, let me hear. Let me see if I can take my background off. Because that <laughs> makes it all dumb. There. Virtual background. We'll turn that off. Oh, look at this. It's, that's crazy. Oh, yeah. Oh, so you like, yeah, you like playing it out. Everything's going to spin. And so what happened? It just never. I just submitted never... it. Uh, like, I can't do the work myself. And then. All right. <laughs> um. Nothing happened so I, with it. I've got my YouTube stack being worked on right now. What I did was I did a community giveaway. So we're going to give away one rare card and then the number one mint of that stack um, to whoever is the winning design. So far, we've got three designs or so that have come up. I like all of them. So I, I don't know what we're going to do. Maybe maybe we should do like, you know, a, a monkey TV uh five stack series that comes out or something. I don't know. There it's go. probably not going to happen. I'm probably going to get in trouble for saying that. It's, it's, I'm, I'm getting messages right now. I'm in so much trouble. Um, <laughs> One of those damn ideas again. Yeah. That's this guy just, why, why, who in the hell's idea was this to put him on the internet? So, um, but yeah, so that was my idea. Cause I, you know, I'm not a designer by trade. I, I do very little graphics and stuff when it comes to videography stuff, but um, you know, we're doing that. And then I've also got somebody kind of designing a logo. Um, so we're trying to pimp, pimp the YouTube, if you will. Yeah. We, um, we had a girl that used to come on here, an artist. She was like, I believe she was like 15 or something. I think she's in Venezuela and she was, she, she was kind of a regular, you know, she'd show up every, every couple of weeks or every month. And then, she was a huge Crypto Monkey fan as well. And so one time when Soggy and Oops came on, she got on and was able to like meet them for the first time. And she ended up doing a collab for one of the cards, like oh, off cool. of one of her real life paintings. And yeah, her name's Lilav. I'm not sure what the card Do you know card which card? Is. I'm trying to think oh. right now. Re do you know Recurrier by any chance? No. 
Let's see, I'll open up the cards and see. Um, see sometimes it's out. it ends up as like a, a background item or something. So like I, I'm thinking maybe junk art monkey. Just think. I'm probably wrong. No. Well, if if somebody was in the chat that could uh, guide that, that would be pretty awesome. But I yeah, don't know. I'm gonna see if I can find it too over here in the gallery. Yeah, rock and roll. But yeah, I mean these things are these things are all over the place, and 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 I, I really like looking at the cards from like the very beginning to now in terms of like how her just even the way that her art style, Soggy's art style, has developed um, over you know, the beginning until now, it's really, it's really amazing. Like you can notice a little bit of details, like the nose on the monkey changed after the first few. Um, the color schemes have gotten a little bit more vibrant and, and kind of We've more encompassing that. recently. Um, and so what's really, here's an, a, a nice, interesting tidbit about Gen 5, which is where we are right now. Um, this series, she stated on our last interview, is going to be focusing um, mainly or more so on the ecosystem. So we've got, we've had a lot of, you know, stuff that has to do with social things happening in the world and then memes and, and, and the, and the alien world stuff. I mean, we've had cards all over the place. Um, but this time we've had, you know, we've had Banano Chan, who is a, a huge contributor in the Banano community, um, making memes and, and images and stuff. So we had a whole card devoted to them. And, and then, you know, we've got, um, we've got just a slew of stuff coming out and, and I know it's, I'm very excited because now I can look at the cars and I'm like, Oh, I bet I, th I think I know what this one's about, you know? And I've been yeah. trying to do that on the YouTube channel, giving my opinion, making sure I've got my guess in first. We have a channel for monkey guessing. If you guess the name of the next card, yeah. you get the next card. And I'm not sure if it's the number one mint or a very low mint, but um, certainly used, not going to be the 19. <laughs> I used to try and I failed so badly every time. <laughs> really? <laughs> the point that, yeah, I never got even remotely close. So I, I just, I was like, oh, I can't do it anymore. I can't take so the they, they released three cards recently. I was, I was really close on the last one. I, I was the first to answer it as Bantano said correctly, but mine did not have, or did have an S at the end or something. So, um, I, I was like in the other five people who also got it pretty close, but I didn't get the lowest mint because of the S. So that's, that's the only claim to fame I've had with monkey guessing so far. <laughs> so, but yeah, cool. I mean, I got like a number seven mint of the card. That was awesome. So, yeah. And looking, looking through the collection here, I'm pretty sure it is the one you called out there. John Cart monkey. I'm pretty sure that's the little Av collab. Oh, right on. Yeah. Yeah. And the card I guessed was Banano Sunday. That's card number 79. Let me see. I'll pull that up here. You mind if I share real quick? Yeah, no, please. So um, got to make sure that they agree with what I'm sharing. Here we go. Um, ah, this is wild. We don't want that. Where did it go? There it is. Okay. So this is Junk Art Monkey. This is not Junk Art Monkey. This is Banano Sunday. This is the one that I guessed, and I put Banano Sundays. So Banano Sundays are, um, I believe it's bi-weekly and they, they kind of have a community call where everyone comes in and they talk about um, everything that's happening in like the Banano ecosystem, including crypto monkeys. Um, and so the, the, the reference to this, um, let me click out of this. No, click out. Oh, the reference to this was in this card. This is kind of just how you can you can learn about how the monkey guessing works. In our previous card, this is Banano Chan, right? This is a, a huge reference to the art that she does um, or he or whoever does within the community. Um, but right here on this computer, you can see there's a Sunday and then there's, you know, like a banana split right here. So you, I guess you could call that a Sunday. Uh, and so a lot of people guessed Sunday with S-U-N-D-A-E, and that wasn't correct. Um, and so I, you know, I just got lucky or whatever. But there's there's the hint. That's exactly what it is. It is not bathwater. Sitting there with some bathwater, yeah. I'm not the one to explain that. <laughs> there's a lot of memeing going on. Oh, no. Stop sharing. Okay, there we go. You. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, there's a whole lot of meme stuff going on. It's a really fun community, guys. I mean, the, the, the truth of it is you both understand. and But anybody watching... Um, it's really a fun place to just go. There's always somebody chatting. If you're bored, you know, you want to waste 30 minutes while you're, you're waiting in the car to do something, 
you can get in there. If somebody's dropping cards, somebody's, you know, air dropping banana and stuff. Um, yeah. Popping jokes, picking on each other. It's a good time. I get picked on a lot. So <laughs> <laughs> it's all in good fun. Monkeying yeah. around, if you will. Monkey that's that's right. Monkey business. Yeah. So that's very cool. Um, what, uh, like big plans for the year? Any big monkey plans for the year that we should uh, be looking forward to or paying attention to? Or is it just coming as it comes? So I am not privy to um, what the printers decide. So there's, again, there's tiers of what we're, we have access to. And so the printers have their own little channel. Um, I should say big channel um, that they, they discuss a lot of stuff in and they throw out a lot of ideas and they're, that's kind of where they discuss what they're going to, you know, do next. And um, I kind of find out <laughs> it's very much like guerrilla warfare on my end. So, so the card comes out and I'm like, Oh crap, I got to make a video, you know, or the stack comes out the same thing. Yeah. Um, but in terms of the plans for the organization, um, there's a real big push, you know, obviously we've, we've created a Twitch account, we've created a YouTube account, um, there's a really big push right now for us to get the word out about this. So we really want people to come into the Discord channel, which is chat.cryptomonkeys.cc. We really want people there. We want to grow sure, this community. It's not a joke. It's not a Ponzi scheme. There's nothing that you have to do. Um, you will have to have a wax wallet. Um, but, you know, when you if you get dropped something by the Green Wizard or G-Wiz, as we call them, uh, you'll be you'll be sent a link, and when you click that link, all of that will just happen. You will set up your wallet. It's it's really very simple, um, but I, I just can't stress enough. Like our our goal is to really grow this and to collaborate with other people, and so we're you know we're collaborating with Left House, um, you know Uncle Rico. I hope we collaborate with you. <laughs> Let's get that thing oh, yeah. going, man. Come on. That thing's um, been going for like. <laughs> six months it is Just gonna can't, happen can't Let's get do this. when i get off of this i'm gonna tag you in the monkey stacks proposal channel and say uncle rico is ready to roll <laughs> <laughs> yeah man. but you know and i don't have a i don't have like a timeline so i don't have exactly what what's gonna happen in front of me but i can tell you that um soggy has tons of amazing ideas so she's gonna keep pumping out awesome cards I can tell you that the same thing is happening with the stacks. I feel that that has been ramped up and I'm super pumped about that. Um, you know, Viren is sort of like, he's, he's one of the printers. I feel like he's sort of like the, the evil genius Dexter type character. If you ever, did you guys ever watch Dexter, the cartoon? Yeah. So that's, that's, he doesn't look like that, but that's kind of like his role is he's got this, like this, this plan and he's like, you know, genius level coding stuff. And he, you know, he manages all that. And then Bantano is kind of handling this, the, the big push for marketing and kind of the overall. Um, and, and he's a very, very busy guy, but he's got a plan and, um, and it's, it's working. So I really think they're just going to keep pushing hard. We're trying to grow our community as much as we can by giving away free stuff. It's, it's harder to beat. Uh, that's a really hard thing to beat. So um, I think we're going to grow more. I think we're going to continue um, to onboard new monkeys and just give out tons and tons and tons of NFTs. Every single day I see new collaborations where we're just giving away hundreds of, of NFTs to them to just give out to their people. Like, just like, Oh, here you go. Give, here's 300. Go, you know, give these yeah. to your people and in the hopes that they'll come in and, and become part of our community as well. So I think that's what we're going to be doing. Growth. That works. 2022. Effect, baby. Oh yeah. yeah. That's and we're awesome. doing exponential growth, baby. Yeah. We've got a question about the discords there that you were mentioning a little bit. Yes. Um, this, one of our family members here is asking, what is the oh, relationship the to crypto monkeys and, and the Bantano server? And also what is the requirement the for citizenship as time uh, in the server and engagement doesn't seem to count towards it? All right, so uh, so I think they were saying the banana server, right? If there's a secret yes, banana yes. server, I'm sorry. I am unaware of it. Um, <laughs> maybe banana, it's like a yeah. fan club where they post like they post like scantily clad drawings. <laughs> I don't think that's I don't think that's something anyone wants to be part of. But um, you know the okay, so the banana server again, we call that the jungle. That's the main chat room for the Crypto Monkey server. We call that Monkey Chat. That's the main server. Again, there's a million different channels within each of that um, that talk about the ecosystem. But we have what is the relationship between the two? 
Um, Banano is is it? Banano is the cryptocurrency. I am I am uh, I love Banano. It's awesome. Again, it's feeless. It's free. It's fairly distributed, and it's freaking fun. It's a lot of fun to be a part of. Everybody tips. Tip, 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 all over the place. You say something funny, someone sends you a tip. You make a fart joke, somebody sends you a tip. You do nothing, somebody sends you a tip. There's an airdrop, you were active. Um, but in terms of the question about the relationship, Crypto Monkeys is inspired uh, by Banana. So again, Soggy Apple Pie is uh, in the, the Jungle Council or whatever. She's one of the, 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 the higher ups in that organization of Banana. And this is a spinoff, same thing with Bantano. Um, this is this is something that they pulled aside and said, hey, um, you know, that we can do it with NFTs too. you know, so NFTs and crypto are both in that same space. And we want both of these to be an easily accessible um, thing for young folks, old folks, anyone who's like, hey, what's an NFT? Boom, here's one. I'll even drop you one. If you show up in monkey chat and you're like, I don't have an NFT yet. And you tag me, Mayor Bancelot or just Mayor, I will drop you one. Okay, but I can only do like 20 a day. So um, the citizenship thing in the jungle, what is citizenship? It's just a little flag beside your name, but essentially it, gain, it gives you access to more stuff within the server and you're able to receive airdrops. So, um, and I think they call them rains over there in the jungle. Um, and so sometimes somebody rains, rains bananas yeah. down on people and that's why everybody wants to have citizenship. But I think, I think, the qualification for citizenship is 20 pages of chat. So what does that mean? If you want to be part of the communities, provide value, right? Get in there, chat, get to know people, be a cool person. Don't be a douchebag. Be nice or don't. I mean, just, just be yourself, chat, and be part of stuff. Um, and then eventually you will be granted citizenship. I remember the day I was granted citizenship. It was really weird. And then everybody says, win poem and then you have <laughs> they expect you to write a poem and so you you know you do that and they put it yeah. down for all eternity so I've written it's a good time over there. there as well so what i've written a few poems over there myself yeah i'm gonna have to i'm gonna have to ask somebody to publish those whenever uh, whenever we get out of here <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but yeah that's the connection so it's it's that you really you can't have one without the other I think it's hard to be involved in just one. There are some people who are or are not in the Crypto Monkey server, and they're and vice versa. A lot of people find Crypto Monkeys, and then they're like, "What's Banana?" Um, but we have tip bots that are set up for both. So there's a Banana tip bot, and then there's the Tip.cc bot, which kind of handles all sorts of cryptocurrencies. That's the one we use for um, Crypto Monkeys, and so it's it's pretty automatic. You just people send it to you, and it just sets it up, and, um, yep. and you there you go. So. Easy peasy. We try to be pretty easy. Yes. Like I said, easy is not because automatic stuff happens. It's because we have an amazing team who has put right. in a lot of work and a lot of time. Um, and like I said, once I gained access as a super, it was like, holy crap, these people are doing a lot. So yeah, it is not a it is not a, a, a stationary thing. It is an ever changing and ever evolving organization. Yeah, it has to be. That's a huge part of being able to bring people in is just, like you said, making it as easy as possible for them to, to enter a new space and understand and have a some sort of comfort level with receiving help from the community and all of that above, which is everything that the monkeys embody over there. It's it's a it's a fun, helpful community. You 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 will not find and I and I argue you will not find a more fun um, overall more fun and more helpful community and more giving uh, community than uh, Crypto Monkeys and Banano. Um, they, they are one and the same and you should join both. So the chat, by the way, for, for um, there is a citizen poem room there if you want to read the past poems. Yes. So we, if somebody wants to pull up his poem real quick, he's over <laughs> here actually, pull his poem up. Um, so the, the chat link for Banano is chat.banano.cc. So both of those bring you to a web page. You click it, it opens up Discord. You verify that you're not, uh, you know, a fake human or a robot, um, and then you're in. Um, and the cool thing is, once you get into our servers, ask questions, people answer. It's very, very helpful. Uh, it's awesome. Yeah, monkeys are one of the best. So we always say it around here. There's uh, very little poo flinging, so. <laughs> <laughs> Not none, just very little. 
I've flung a little. I've had a little flung at me. So, you know, it is what it is. You can't you can't have people from all over the world in one room um, and not and not get into a little bit of a scuffle here and there. But again, it's, there's never anything major. And, and um, there are so many moderators. Um, I'm starting to get inundated by sunlight here. Um, there are so many moderators um, that that handle it, that it's it's a relatively safe place, you know, um, and especially with crypto monkeys, we expect there to be younger folks. Um, and so um, they're coming in with NFTs. Honestly, young folks are all over this NFT thing. I'm an old fart. I'm 35. So like I I'm like, what's that? You know, <laughs> and now that I've got a taste of it, I'm like, I love this. I think it's great and um, can't be free. So. I think some of the members, some of the monkeys might be in here in our private uh, stream yard chat trying to get on the stream. I'm not sure. Oh, oh Marcito and Glitter Fart. <laughs> <laughs> I, I am aware of both of those people. What are they trying to do? They're trying know. to like, you guys, well, you want to bring them in? You guys want to come on real quick? Do you have something Glitter, to do? Uh, Glitter Fart can come in. All right. Let's bring old Glitter Fart in But here. listen, if you're going to come in here, you better show your face. Um, uh, very very reasonable ask. Or we will accept an actual fart. Of hey, this is what you look like. <laughs> Guys, this is my first time seeing him. Hello, so hello. Here we are. I was, I was kind of hoping he'd go for option number two and actually fart glitter. Ah, uh, we don't want that. <laughs> that that, well, that would have been an quickly. acceptable alternative. We don't want to do that. So what's up, man? Welcome. Thank you. Thank you. I just saw your post in the announcements, so I thought... I might just jump in and uh, look around. <laughs> Didn't well, expect to actually join the conversation here. <laughs> oh, did, you, did you post the stream yard in your announcement? I think no. I posted it in the announcements. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so I that's actually how... <laughs> have like a hundred notifications right now, so I have no. <laughs> Everybody got a link looking, to come so... and join us on the stream here, basically. <laughs> Yeah. So we yeah we would share the YouTube could go out this um, but this is fine too. It's a monkey Friday. We monkey around. You know, you never know what's gonna happen. There you go. Well, now we we've got. Some, I mean, I'm uh, glad that glitter fart actually showed up. You popped in a couple times. I kicked you out a couple times. I don't mean to be <laughs> rude. I just had no clue who you were, or what was going on. Uh, He's on a bunch that, of servers. Maybe, I'm on. Maybe He's that should just the be the thing. Like every Friday. We do, you do something in the uh, CryptoMonkey server and every Friday a new CryptoMonkey um, community member can come on and just be a guest. I uh, like it. Yes, it, it might be a thing. Right <laughs> Stoned Rabbit, another great name. Hello, hello. Hello. So I, hello. what I haven't realized is that there's a there's a tab over here that like has the chat that I haven't been reading, so. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm happy to answer any questions that I can. Again, the two of you have been around in the community longer than I have. I've just been I, working really hard to try to understand more and, and be a voice, um, a proponent, you know, for, for crypto monkeys as a whole. Cause I, I really think it's great. Um, I wouldn't have stuck around if I didn't. So, so I, you I, know, maybe, maybe I'll give you a little, um, OG quiz action. Let's go. Um, do you know what the actual genesis of number 19 is? So, um, well, I know, I know that the number 19 is the atomic number of potassium. So, uh -huh. um, but I know that there's another reason that I am unaware of, and I'm just going to warn you. I know that you may or may not be, um, continuing your service, but, I was speaking to <laughs> all of the management about their videos and Bantano mentioned that he might reveal the real meaning of number 19. So before you do it, I would think very hard. I, I'm about not going to, I just heat. wanted to know if you know, <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to know. I'm going to front run know. Bantano on his own. Uh, no, no, no. Be. <laughs> hey, before be you completely know it, your whole honest. computer crashes and your house sets on fire. Like I'm telling you, he's like the Terminator. So he told, he told me at one point and I just don't recall what it is. I just know it's, it didn't come from the atomic number, but that's the accepted truth. Yeah, there's there's something. There's going to be a lot of interesting information um, released here in the next, I'm hoping, few months. I know that we're going to talk about what the codes on the back of the cards are for. And I know that anyone that has cards is very excited about that because, you know, we obviously know that those codes are connected to a real life band address. Um, 
a banana address. So what does that mean? To me, that means that there may be some type of opportunity to maybe hit the lottery. I don't know. I mean, oh, I wonder if huh, I'm going to have to, um, but that's what it is. I'm going to have to scan that, that QR code. I'm interested. So, but, but yeah, you can scan it now. I don't think you're going to get anything, but I, no, but, no, no, you wouldn't get anything. I'm wondering if you could send to it for today. I just joined the server. Yes. Yes. So we've got a new monkey. If yeah. I've done nothing else, I brought somebody in. That's awesome. Right. Cool. Where wh do you know where, um, you know what banana was launched from, right? Educate me. I'm, I'm not sure if I understand the question. So banana is a fork of the nano chain. Correct. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And because they just put their, their code out there. They said, here, copy this. Yeah. And then everyone said, well, why in the hell would we hold nano then? <laughs> so right. nano has been taking. And, uh, banana, and that's banana. I always say banana is um, nano's doge. No, nano's dogecoin. Yeah. Well, I don't have any nano and I, I'm super, I'm super pumped about banano. And the reason yeah. behind that is because it's over three years old. Um, it has an incredible following and it's a wholesome following and it's people that don't really care about the price. I mean, every, the whole joke is that it's like, you know, one band equals one band, no matter what the price is. Right. Yeah. But even during, um, you know, the, the awful crypto winter that everyone came out of, you know, a few years ago, the community was thriving. It's just doing what they normally do, posting memes, tipping each other. The tips were a little bit higher than they are now, but um, you know, it's still, it's still the same wholesome fun place that it used to be. Um, and I, and I, that's why I am, I am pumped about that community as a whole uh, and its survival. Um, no matter what, uh, it's not going anywhere. Nano yeah. might tank and, uh, and I don't think anybody in our community is going to care, but it's because they don't have that, um, that wholesome community that, that actually cares about, um, that community, you know? Right. Glitterfart knows about that. Where are you? I'm trying to do everything backwards. He knows about that community. <laughs> it's very true. It's like one of my first um, first time that I come across uh, NFTs. Then I came across the Banano server in the Banano Discord. And yeah, it's a great community. I learned a lot there. So uh, it's very fun to uh, be around there. Thank you, Omarcito. <laughs> My man is all over the server too. He is, he's like a, he's a huge cheerleader. That's awesome. Um, but yeah, I mean, we're, we're, uh, we're happy to take anybody in. Please come in, please chat, um, behave yourself. If you're not a, if you're not a jerk, we might even let you stay. So, um, but uh, yeah, happy to answer any questions that I possibly can. It appears that you guys probably will answer them better than I will. So I'll just, I'll just sit here and listen. Well, I, I'm, I'm good on like the old school stuff, but I've been slacking recently. I just have, have had trouble keeping up with, um, everything. I mean, you know, banana and, and crypto monkeys included, but really everything. So, um, I, I, I know some of the old school stuff though. That's yeah. my, I guess my claim to fame or something. I don't know. Well, I know that there is a push happening, so I'm not, I'm not involved in any official capacity with the banana team but i um i do know that uh recently there was a new installation of a community manager who is very marketing minded and so i'm um and i've worked with them on on quite a few different uh little projects to try to help push banana through uh, again you know we're here to talk about crypto monkeys but it is it is impossible yeah, uh, to talk about it without talking about banana. They are, they are, you know, I say brother and sister, but they are one and the same, you know, one does not exist without the other. Um, and, and it's interesting because both communities are freaking rad and fun, yeah. you know, yeah. um, and here you are. Yeah. Free are key features, right? It's fast. It's feeless. It's, it's freely distributed. Um, do you, do you fold? So I did fold and I destroyed my computer doing it. So um, <laughs> I don't fold anymore. I just buy. So when I buy dips happily um, and I will, I will do it again. Yeah. Um, I have, no luckily I have um, some spare boxes that I can just let them run and not worry uh, yeah. so much. Yeah. My last laptop, I, I left it running during a hiking trip for a weekend and I left it on, on like high instead of medium. Uh, and you could touch it and it's like it could fry an egg. 
Um, yeah. And yeah, I, and I, I, I like, I think something's wrong. And I looked at the, the metal was warped on the top of the, <laughs> of the yeah. keyboard. Um, and then when I went to make one of my videos, my GPU just wasn't working anymore. So I killed yeah. it. But yeah. Banana, yeah. man, it has an amazing mobile wallet. I mean, it's just the yeah. simplest and easiest mobile wallet. And the something I, I, I didn't even mention is that it's it's instantaneous. Like it is instantaneously yeah. fast. Yeah. If I sent one of you guys Banano right now, I, I could no. clap my okay. hands. All right. Well, <laughs> honestly, the push, fastest. Hey, tell you what, push your QR code on the screen and I'll shoot you some band right now. We can no, no, no. I'm good. I have I have plenty, but we should give some out to the audience. It is unbelievably fast. It's so stupid fast. It's got all that all that really stuff that, that that Nano had, but better. Um, it's an improved version of Nano. So Nano can go, I don't know, go do something, go kick rocks. Um, but Nano all the way, baby. Um, yeah, when I first downloaded, uh, I went with the Kalium app for uh, my wallet there, and. I honestly, it was the fastest transaction I had ever seen in like three, three years in crypto or whatever, it's you know, dumb. I mean, it's yeah. really stupid fast and I'm a big algo fan. So I'm like a huge Algorand nut. Um, that has been my, you know, my, my go-to from the beginning. Um, because I believe, I still believe that it's a great one. And, um, and it's super fast. It's like a four second transaction, but, but banana is even faster than that. It's like when you click the button, by the time you open the window where it's supposed to go, it's already there, you know? Unbelievable. Yep. But yeah, I mean, look at, I mean, you can go on their website and just play, you know, there's so, there's so much happening in the banana and crypto monkeys, uh, communities. It's the best thing you can do is, is go on the websites, check them out, join the chats, um, and just start poking around. There's so much more than I could even, I mean, we could spend hours here talking about it. You don't want to hear me do that, but, um, you know, it's fun. It's not, there's not a lot of places that you can go. That's as fun as it is to learn about stuff, you know? Yeah. For and sure. get free shit the whole time. This, I cussed. I'm sorry. I said ah, a bad okay. word. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm starting to burn. I'm no, no, like no. trying to avoid the window light. So no, we're all adults here. Yeah. Well, maybe <laughs> adultish. We're all old enough to pose as adults. <laughs> Fair enough. So, yeah. yeah, I'm super, I'm super happy. I, I'm, I'm happy you guys had me on. Um, I, you know, anything I can do to, to kind of help spread the crypto monkeys gospel, if you will, uh, I'm all about it. Um, and, you know, I may not be the most knowledgeable. I am definitely not the most knowledgeable, but I am, uh, I am eager and I am, I am bullish on both projects, both uh, crypto monkeys and banana. And I know everybody says that about their, their stuff. Everybody says it, you know, so it's that, you know, hearing me say that doesn't mean anything, but I think you've got nothing to lose. You literally have nothing to lose and everything to gain by just going to the discord server, joining it. Even if you just let it sit there for a while and do nothing. And then one day you're bored for 20 minutes and you come in and chat, tag me. Um, my, my username, if you type in, let me see, I'm just going to type in, what my what do we look like at mayor underscore dance a lot that will be good enough for you to find me i don't know what the numbers are at the end but um if you do that i will send you a drop just for watching just this program dm you my monkey stack you don't get a drop sir <laughs> no 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 i'm not looking for a drop <laughs> i'm looking for a monkey stack Oh, I got a stack. Here it is. I've got it right here. There we yeah. go. All right. I want to make it happen. Okay. So what I'll do is I'm going to forward that into the monkey stacks proposal uh, channel, and then yeah. I'm going to tag you, and we're going to see if the gears get working. I can what? I can give the um the help Camino the car. I can give that as a, a PNG or whatever. But I need somebody to draw me a monkey and make it spin around. Cornet is a is an, an animating genius. So um, I just need a monkey, a right. monkey with a hat and a microphone. That's it. I think that's, that's possible. Yeah, you should see easy. the. You should see the. Um, can I share the screen again, real quick? Yeah, um, please. The um, the monkey stacks that are proposed um, for my channel. Hold on, how do I do this? Let's see. Share channel. Here we go. 
Share screen. Let's do that. Tell me when you see it. There it is. So here's the first one. Let's talk about stacks, baby. <laughs> All right. You I know love it. it, dude. All right. So that's one of the options, right? Um, here's the other option. So this is this is Cornet. So I was saying you you know might be able to help you with that. Um, a oh, cool little three D spin. I like the um, I like the little caricature. Yeah. Of. So that was done by Fried. His name's Fried. Um, yeah, that's and good. that's actually my YouTube or my um, my Twitter picture as well. And so here's one as well. Um, just another option, kind of mimicking a lot of the stuff that's happened on the show. So um, this yeah, is we got a lot of monkey stacks being proposed in here, guys. And this is a public channel. Like here's a new one that's that's maybe coming out soon. Um, and then what I'm going to do is right now I'm going to say at Recurrier needs help with his stack stat there it is the, the the process has been started so um it's out there look for that once again that's right it's, back it's happening that, baby. baby i gotta hold on i got the thing on my phone so i gotta do that I gotta do look the at thing this the thing omar omar c Tuf has seemed to be helping uh, i don't know that i think mm -hmm. all of us have crypto monkeys so I think you this one just got there first. Ah, look at that. Someone's giving out. How do you know? I mean, this is the community, guys. It's like, um, it's amazing. You're, you're not going to find that on OpenSea or some type of Ethereum blockchain where it costs 150 bucks, not only to make something, but then to send it, right? So nobody's giving away stuff. This is this is unparalleled. Um, you really, you really got to get to be part of this, so... But that's what I want to say in closing. I want to tell everybody, if you join our Discord, chat.cryptomonkeys.cc, I link will again. drop you a crypto monkey if you tag my name. Now, you got to be patient with me. Um, there's also a channel for introductions. So if you introduce yourself, um, there uh, one of our other community moderators handles all that. So you give yourself a nice introduction, you're going to get dropped something. So... Um, there's literally like four or five places right off the bat that you could just participate in and get something for free you, yeah. to do nothing except just participate. You can't beat that. So, and I would argue that you should join up in banana as well. Uh, mm -hmm. Jungle might be a little intense at times, but it slows down sometimes. But again, it's a lot of fun. There's a lot of memes uh, and it's, it's a good place to be. There's no doubt about it. That's for sure, and I'm I'm glad to see that uh, that someone like yourself has joined the team, and that you're you know putting your face out there and, and being active, and uh, I love it. I love to see. I don't it. know if it's a good thing yet or not, but we'll see. <laughs> of course, you do. You know what you're doing. <laughs> well, guys, thank you for having me on. I really, really appreciate it. Um, I want to I want to offer. A chance to ask any other questions if you have them. I'm sure you don't. Oh, you we should, we should do a grubfish give away some monkeys. Definitely. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell me what to do. Um, we will. I don't have it. What's a grubfish? Show me what a grubfish is. Oh my god, well, dude, you grubfish got Grubfish oh is god. a critter craft game, Grubfish Royale, and it's we do giveaways. A lot of what we do here at the Action Family NFT Action News is inspired from the crypto monkeys. We give every single day, Monday through Friday, we have giveaways. Nice. Um, Monday through Thursdays are, are locked up to the holders of our NFTs, the Action Family Club cards. And then on Fridays, we open it up to the public so anybody can go over to Twitch and put the exclamation point play in the chat on Twitch once we get it going here and uh, take part in winning some NFTs from the wax side over nice. here. Nice. Yeah. Inspiring the world, changing the NFT world one free drop at a time. <laughs> Gee whiz, I mean, will change everyone. Yeah, and you go back and on the, I think it was the banana side and you look at the roadmap and it's like starts in 2018, you know, yeah. so it's pretty rad to see that just in itself that they've been around for many years in the space and how both Constant communities. development. And I think yeah. that's, you know, you, you evolve or die. Right. And, um, a lot of people, you know, are like we build it and, and if people show up or they don't. Right. But here it's, we build it and then we fix it and then we build it better. And then we build a new thing. 
And then we work on that. We fix it. And then we distribute it. We give it away. And then we do another. And, and um, it's a constant work in progress. Um, and I can't speak enough about the community. They're, they're awesome. Um, every, just everyone. I really like first thing I do when I wake up in the mornings, I get my pot of coffee going. And my first message usually is just like, what's up monkeys. And then it's just like, what? you know, it just starts happening. Right. Yeah. The um, floodgates are open. Yeah. We do trivia, man. We drop, we do trivia where, you know, you ask questions and, and if people answer them right. They get a drop. Sometimes we do trivia with band, simple questions like A, B, C, D. If you click the right answer, you get some free band. You can't beat it, man. Well, guys, I got to say, this was a lot more fun than I was expecting. So I, I, uh, <laughs> I was, I, I had no, I had no expectations really. I edited it until about three fifty-five, and then um, messaged you and was like, Hey, where's this link? Um, or yeah, recurrier, I messaged you and got the link. And then, um, and here we are and, and an hour and 15 minutes later, uh, and it's still pretty fun. So thank you to everybody. Uh, thank you both for having me on. Thank you everybody for, for joining. Um, I really mean it. We, we really want you in our server. It's, we're not, we're not earning anything off of you. It's not a, it's not a Ponzi scheme and there's no, there's no trick. In fact, I'm sure it costs, um, printers quite a bit um, to, to do this project and to put it on, but it is, it is such a great um, introductory NFT and cryptocurrency um, thing for, for anyone, for anyone, all ages. So um, we'd love to see you there. Definitely. Definitely. Thank you for coming by and spitting all the, all the info out at us. With us. All right. Sure. I'm looking forward to the link of this guys. Take care. Yes, sir. You do the same, Mayor. All Rico, right. you got any parting words? No, man. Sending out some crypto monkeys and enjoy uh, the weekend. That's right. Love it. Peace, guys. Have a great weekend. Peace, Mayor.